Welcome back to Asia's Fit Pilates. Today is a lower body Pilates and strength workout. We'll be using no equipment today, but if you'd like to up the intensity, you can absolutely grab a set of dumbbells for this. This routine will include squats and lunges, so if you feel like that's gonna be too harsh on your knees, I'll link another video above or in the description that might be better suited for you. We're doing the warm up, 20 lower body exercises, and stretching at the end. So let's get right into it. Our warm up, let's start by warming up the hamstrings. You're gonna bring one leg in front. You're going to sweep the arms, hinging back at the hips, and come back up. Go the other leg. Sweeping up and return. Keep going. Bring the arms down. Let's do a regular squat. So bring your legs hip distance apart. We're gonna bend down. You can bend the arms up as well and come back up. Let's begin. So just go as low as is comfortable for you. We can deepen it in our workout. I try to sit back on my heels and pick up my toes a little bit so I can get more into those glutes. Let's do a calf raise. We're going to come up onto the toes. You can raise your arms and lower down. Let's begin. Let's do a reverse lunge. Bring one leg back, lunge, come back to center, and other leg. Keep going. Now let's turn our feet out into a V. We'll squat down. You can place your hands on your hips and come back up. Let's begin. Good, now stay down, lift the heels. Come up, okay, let's move on. Let's start with the feet in parallel, right next to each other, this will be a narrow squat. We're gonna squat down and come back up. Let's begin. If this feels like too much on your knees, you can always separate your feet and see if that helps. It's a lot of knee flexion here, a lot of bending.
Okay, let's do a calf raise. Have the feet hip distance apart. We'll be doing about 15 to 20 seconds of rest between each of the exercises. So you can do the demo with me or you can just watch and rest. We're going to do the same thing as a warm up, coming up and lower down. Let's begin. Okay, the next one we're gonna do a V squat. I'll show you from the side this time. Keeping the legs wide, turn the feet out. Try to squat deep if you can. So if you can tap the floor, that would be great. Do what's comfortable for you though. Let's begin. Shake the legs out. Next, we'll work the hamstrings. We're going to, you can keep the arms down, hinge back, slight bend in the knees, come as low as is comfortable for you, and come back up. Let's begin. Come up, legs are hip distance apart. We're going to squat down, lift the heels, come up and come down. It's a hard balance one. We'll go one way and then reverse the other direction. Let's begin. So squatting down, lift the heels, come up and come down. Let's go the other way. So coming up, lower slowly, come down, drop those heels, come back up. Come up. Next we're gonna work the thigh, the side of the leg here. You can hold on to something if you need to. We're gonna have the leg bent. We're gonna raise it up and lower down. Try to keep your balance here. <laughs> Let's be good. Let's go the other side.
Go ahead and shake that out. Next, we're gonna do a calf raise again, but we're gonna do it while we're sitting in a squat. You can keep your arms out. We're just going to lift the heels up and come down. Let's begin. Quads are burning. <laughs> Shake that out. Okay, gave you all that time to rest. Uh, side lunge now. So come to one side, weight in the heel, come back up. And other one. Shake it out. We'll do a reverse lunge next. Let's do it with an arm raise. So bringing the leg back, arms raise up, and come back down. We'll switch halfway through. Let's begin. Switch legs. Check it out, one more left standing, and we'll get on the ground. Squat hold, squatting down. You can raise your arms up if you like, and we're gonna hold. Let's begin. Can you go lower? Come up. Ooh. Ouch. All right, let's go to the ground. We're gonna start with some kneeling exercises. I'm gonna be on my hands for this, but if you wanna be on your forearms, if that's more comfortable for your wrists, that is absolutely fine as well. Let's start by bringing one leg up. Flex the foot, we're going to lift up, and then lower back down. Let's begin.
Come down. We'll go to the other side. Flex that foot. Let's begin. it back. Come back up. Now we're going to add on. Come back up. Straighten the leg. Bend the leg. Lower down. Let's begin. So adding in a little hamstring work. Other side. the back. Come up. Now we're going to go out to the side. Lift and lower. Let's begin. Other side. it back. Now we're going to combine those. So lifting up, come down, out to the side and down. Let's begin. I love kneeling glute work because it works your core as well. A little bit into your shoulders to support you. Other side. Sit back, we have one left. One left for the kneeling. Coming up, we'll do a rainbow with the legs. The leg's gonna be straight out. We lift it across and then out to the side. Let's begin.
Switch legs. it back. Let's get onto our backs now and we'll do some glute work. So lying down, legs are hip distance apart. Let's bridge up. One leg goes out. We're going to lower and lift. Let's begin. Just go to a height that's comfortable for you. If this bothers your knee, that supporting knee, you can try to bring your foot a little further away and see if that feels more comfortable. Less bending flexion of the knee. Bend that leg. I'm tired. <laughs> Let's do the other side. Bring that leg down, come down to rest. Next, we'll do a single leg bridge. Everyone's favorite, <laughs> they, they are tough. So we're gonna bridge up, place one leg into tabletop. We're gonna lower and lift. Let's begin. Put that leg down. Glute is burning. Let's see again. Great, put that leg down, come down. You can bring your knees in. Next we'll do a regular bridge and we're gonna pulse at the end. Let's begin. Really squeeze at the top. And pulse for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And come down. Knees come in. Now we're going to make that more hamstring focused by putting our feet further away on purpose. <laughs> so come up into a bridge, walk your feet out. And we're gonna bridge like this. So you're gonna come down and come back up. If they start to cramp, walk your feet back in. Let's see again.
come down. Knees come in. Last one, put your feet into a V. Heels are together, toes are apart. We're gonna bridge up and the pulse at the end. Let's begin. And pulse for 10, nine, I feel the burn, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and come down. Oh my gosh, I feel that so much. Glutes, inner thighs. All right, let's stretch. Let's start with a glute stretch. So bring your feet down, bring one leg across, Keep that down or bring it closer towards you to deepen the stretch. Switch legs. Let's sit up. We'll do a hamstring stretch. Legs out in front. Might feel tight. <laughs> Bend forward and hold. Let's do a butterfly stretch, bend the knees in. Feet come in and then knees are wide. We'll hold here. Come up. Great job for making this far. I hope you enjoyed this workout and I will see you next time.